Good okay, man. I'll let you guys borrow my rocket ship. Thank you. <laughs> I can't with them. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Charming Gang? We're gonna be checking out the SMO movie, Jeffy's Rubik's Cube. Never in my life have I ever completed a Rubik's Cube. Or I have completed one, but it was through cheating, so that doesn't really count. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the second channel. Link is gonna be in the description below. Go subscribe right now, hit that notification bell. That way you're always notified whenever I post a video. Ooh, Jeffy, is that oh, a Rubik's Cube? He already has it. Nope, clearly not. <laughs> Jeffy, if you're trying to solve that, those things are the impossible. Office. They're only for smart people. Well, then I guess I am smart. What? what Jeffy, you actually solved it? He's well, smart, man. I may be slow, <laughs> but I solved this hoe. And since I solved this Rubik, I'm going to smack this pubic. All right, Jeffy, go ahead. Can I mess it up so you can try solving it thing. again? Sure, mommy. No, Jeffy, seriously, how'd you solve that? Dang, it's easy. All you got to do is match the colors together. Marvin, okay, Jeffy, here you go. maybe you're All the right, dumb watch one. Watch me work. Okay. It doesn't right. look like he's solving it. It looks like he's messing it up. Dunion rings. Are you <laughs> again? Like you got 10 seconds. 10 seconds? That's not even my fastest time. I can solve it in four seconds. I can do it in seconds, two seconds. Jeffy, that's amazing. No, you I can't. can set a world record. I can't. Yeah, I am pretty smart. <gasps> Daddy? Uh, cheese in my ear? Uh, what type of cheese you think it is? I think it might be a sharp cheddar. Ew. Uh, that's a little Velveeta. No, Jeffy, that's not cheese. Velveeta? That's <laughs> that's What's the last disgusting. time you cleaned your ears, Jeffy? You're supposed to clean your ears? Every I day. I your ears were for hearing. <sighs> Baby, go get him a Q-tip. Okay. All right, Jeffy. There's going to be so much gook in there. What do I do with these? You put it in your ear. This is going to be You're gross. In my ear? This is going to be Ooh. so gross. Yeah, like that. Now you move it around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, relax. Jeffy, be careful. You're going to hurt your eardrum. Yeah, Jeffy, you don't want to push it too far. You might hurt your ear. Oh! Daddy, look. I made a cheese stick. Oh, oh Jeffy, please stop. Mm, dang, that was so good. You that's blue disgusting. cheese. Package it up. Jeffy, that's not blue cheese. cheese. It's earwax. You're not supposed to eat that. <laughs> but, Danny, I have an unlimited supply of cheese in my ear. He said he got it's some good up the in there. World. Jeffy, it's not cheese for the whole world. got some Parmesan. Everyone has that in their ear. <laughs> Daddy, bacon. Dozen as fuck. What, oh, Jeffy? Oh. Marvin, I'm gonna get him a glass of water if he's gonna keep eating his earwax. He needs to stop eating his earwax. He can't be healthy. Seems well, like he likes it. Run out, right? It's nutritious. Oh, hope. All right, Daddy. I got a factory in overdrive. Everyone's about to have cheese for days. All right. Oh, I need some queso water. for my chips. All right, Jeffy. I brought you a water. Oh God. Mommy, check out my cheese. Oh. I made a cheese pyramid. He's making <laughs> shapes. <laughs> Jeffy, get all this earwax <laughs> off the couch. Hold on, Daddy. I got one more good one. Please right, don't. Really gonna be, you're gonna hurt your ear. Marvin, how is he not? He's gonna pull his brain out. No idea. Oh, he did. Daddy, what's this pink stuff? What, Jeffy? It looks like a piece of your brain. That's your brain. Immediately. Okay, call a doctor. ASAP. Hey, somebody call a doctor. Ooh, cheese sticks. No, no. no. That's not cheese. Why would you just eat okay, that? Just earwax on a Q-tip. Why didn't anybody tell me? Because I thought you were smart since you're a doctor. <laughs> yeah, doctors are smart, okay? I cheated to get where I am. Like, there was this fat bitch in front of me in college named Abby. I just copied off her. She's a much more successful Why didn't we hire him? <laughs> yet fat, so I'm winning. Anyway, what do you guys need? Yet so fat. Jeffy was playing with a Q-tip and he dug out a piece of his brain. Okay, look, that's impossible, okay? He'd have to break through his eardrum, which would be extremely painful, and then the Q-tip would touch his skull, and then once it got through to his inner ear, it would cause extreme pain, dizziness, and vomiting, okay? There's no way that would be an accident. It would have to be I on mean, purpose. I mean, there's well, a brain right there. Purpose. He was trying to shove it as deep as he could in his ear. <sighs> okay, let me go get my otoscope. All right, let me take a look in there. Oh, yeah, that yeah, bald spot, brain bro. Doesn't... Wait, so that is his brain? Yeah, that's his brain on the Q-tip. <laughs> is he gonna die? I don't know. How you feel, Jeffy? <laughs> <laughs> is that normal? Yeah, he normally acts like that. Oh, well, look, he'll be just fine then. Look, the brain is so big, you don't need all of it. That little piece on the Q-tip, that's probably like one memory. All right, I'm gonna have to pause him there. I'm pretty sure you need all of your brain, man. Like, I don't think you can go without a piece of your... No, 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 because they do... Uh, they do do uh, one of those split hemisphere and they take out half of your brain. They do do that, but I don't know, man. I think that only works when they know what they're taking out. He just literally shoved a Q-tip up his ear and pulled out a chunk of brain. So that was probably, what, the whole third grade or that's his fine motor skills. I don't know. I wouldn't trust him. And yeah, keep the Q-tips away from him. One memory. He'll be okay. So you think it's just one memory? Oh, yeah. He'll be fine. Yeah. 
That is not one memory. Is that a Rubik's Cube? Yeah, Jeffy can solve a Rubik's Cube in four seconds. Whoa, that's got to be a world not, record. Not you should enter him into the national annual Rubik's Cube Solvatron competition. What's that? Well, it's where a bunch of these dorks who don't get any pussy and have rolling backpacks <laughs> get together to see who can solve a Rubik's Cube the fastest. Rolling I mean, no backpacks. No females are allowed within 500 miles of the competition, but first place gets a $25 gift card to QB Tuesdays and a million dollar cash prize. A million dollars? Why, why the gift card? Yeah, I mean, they're mostly just doing it for the gift card because a million dollars is still not enough to get them laid. They're just going to spend the money to buy more. Or Rubik's cubes, but yeah, <laughs> I can't believe Jeffy, you can make a million dollars. Just give me the money, place. man. Well, I mean, second place, you still get five hundred thousand dollars, and third place gets one hundred thousand. But fourth place gets you executed by firing squad. Oh, they kill you? Then yeah. I won't. Yeah, I, I mean, won't you sign can up. still come in fifth place. You get ten thousand for that. But fourth place, no, they will kill you. Why they, they do not tolerate you? mediocrity. So as long as Jeffy gets fourth place, first, <laughs> second, third, or fifth, he gets money. Yeah, yeah, just don't come in fourth. That would be bad. Oh my God, Jeffy's gonna totally win that competition because he can solve a Rubik's cube in four seconds. So, so when is it? Uh, it's in two hours, but it's five hundred miles. Away. Marvin, we have to travel 250 miles per hour to get that's, there in time. Our car doesn't that's not, that that's not possible, okay, man. Okay, I'll let you guys borrow my rocket ship. Thank you. <laughs> I can't with them. <laughs> the sound Hello effects. Hello <laughs> and welcome to the annual National Rubik's Cube. He said, I'll let you borrow my rocket ship. Like he just has we one on deck. the biggest nerds in the she world did. here protecting their virginities by trying to solve Rubik's Cubes as fast as they can. Protect that virginity. The competition will begin shortly. Let no one have it. I'll get it. Ever. Hello? Trigger drink. We're here for the Rubik's Cube competition. Is that a girl? Yeah. Oh, tell her to get the hell yeah, out of here. You're not allowed. What? Because none of these boys in here have ever seen a girl before, and if they do, they might cream their bridges. Ew! Hey, just go wait in the rocket ship. I don't want to see them cream their bridges. What's the password? Oh, Rubik's Cube dick. Come on in! <laughs> what? How do you know right, that? Jeffy, you ready to beat hey, it's kids? Cody! Yeah, I'll beat the shit out of all these kids. Which kid you want me to hit first? No, not beat them up. I meant beat them in solving a Rubik's Cube. What's up, fresh meat? Hey, Jonathan! Have you been down here before? How you so, been? What's your best time? <laughs> best time? Yeah, your best time is solving a Rubik's Cube, it. Oh, well, I don't solve Rubik's Cubes, but Jeffy's best time is four seconds. Four seconds? He might win first place this Maybe year. that really? piece of brain yeah, see that kid down was there? his Rubik's this Cubes. Jackie, too. He wins first place almost Every year, he's a super Asian, and then <laughs> a super Asian Octavius Rex. <laughs> he has a 12 inch wiener. I saw it in the shower one day after team Whoa. practice. How he, showers, he how does he not have there. a girl then? This competition gets super intense. And let me show you him. That's Cody. He's gay. It's true. He is. Well, Jeffy's gonna try to win first place. Well, you don't have to worry about me. I go for last place every year. Easiest 10 grand of my life. Oh, but my buddy last year, Fred, he died by firing squad because he got fourth place. I would have just and then doing the tower if I was going to get fourth place. He got banned for life. How'd he get banned? Because he, he brought a girl. Someone say girl. Shut up. <laughs> Keep your weight on your pants. Damn. <laughs> oh, okay, well, um, why are girls not allowed? Girls aren't allowed because the last time a girl was here, everyone's pants got filled with cream cheese. Uh, Why don't you cube? Oh, I just don't know how. Uh, you hear that, everyone? Cream this cheese. This guy doesn't know how to cube. <laughs> what a fucking loser. It seems like Marvin <laughs> is the geek here. He's, right, he's the loser everyone, here. We're ready to start the, competition. <laughs> the rest of them are cool. So here's how this is going to work. <laughs> Everyone's going to come up, and mm. we're going to time how fast you can finish a Rubik's Cube. Okay. The person with the fastest time wins a million dollars and a $25 gift card to QB Tuesday. Keep the gift card. The person who comes in fourth place gets murdered. Now, first up <laughs> is our newcomer, Jeffy. Go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section below if you have ever solved a Rubik's Cube. And cheating doesn't count. Peeling off the stickers doesn't count. and then Or looking up to a tutorial online, that doesn't count either. It has to be raw that you finished it, like raw from the box or something. You already know I've never solved one. So if I was in this competition, go for fifth place. I don't, maybe you don't have to solve it. Just be the last person to finish. I, I don't know. That way you get fifth place. But don't go for fourth. Because I'm pretty sure you don't want to go by firing squad. What is this, 1920s? Okay, Jeffy, I'll start the timer by hitting the space bar, and when you're done with the Rubik's Cube, I'll stop the timer by hitting the space bar again. Thank and you. And I'll let you know what your time is. letting us know. The world record is 3.13 seconds. On your mark, 3.13. Go! Yeah, his brain. What am I supposed to do with The this? brain is his Rubik's Cube skills. skills. Jeffy, hurry up and solve it. I don't know what this is. I've yeah. never seen one of these before in my life. Jeffy, don't screw it. He you yanked it out of his head. I did? Yes, Jeffy, solve it. 
I don't even know what this is. What? Oh my god. That brain. Dude, that part of your brain you yep. was the part that made you solve a Rubik's Cube? It has to be because I've never seen one of these before in my life. Uh, mister, he doesn't know how to solve a Rubik's Cube. Don't get fourth place, what? man. Yeah, he, I thought he did, but he doesn't know how to do it anymore. Well, then why in the hell would you come to a Rubik's Cube competition? I don't know. Well, I guess I'll have to give you fifth place. Okay. $10, we'll take that. Just like that. Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Let's go. Come get out of here. Go. There you go. We have Cody Nutkiss <laughs> on your mark. Yes, Ten grand to do nothing. No. Easy yes, money, come on, bro. Cody. Come on, Cody. Come on, Cody. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Prove to them wow, why you're wow. smart. Smells fast. Done. Nice. Wow, six point nine seconds. <laughs> Sixty-nine. Yeah. And up of next, course. we have Dontavius Rex. Hey, the black guy. Mark. Come yes, on, black set. guy. Go. You got this, black guy. Shit, shit. Oh, shit. that's gonna cost him some time. Come on, done? kid. Come on. Hurry up. Ah! Not my best time. Cody Let beat you. Be are, are you gonna finish it? Yeah. Just one second. Someone already okay. took fifth place, man. That's good enough to get a nice smooth fifth place. Oh no! Well, congratulations, <laughs> game in four. Oh! Time to die. <laughs> no, no, please. Please. <laughs> At last, we have the defending champion, Jackie Two. Jackie Two. On the mark, get set. Go. He's so adorable. Look. Everybody can suck my wiener. Okay. Holy moly, he <laughs> broke the world record. You get first place. This man just won a million dollars. Ladies, you need to get yourselves a nerd. I know you want the popular jocks, but bro, the nerds are the ones who are going to make the money in the future. They may not have the most style. They may not have the best body. They may not have the best looks, but they have the best bank account. You know, the odds of a nerd making money and a jock making money the nerd is much more likely. A jock, but your odds of making it to the NFL, NBA, whatever sport you want to do is very low versus a nerd being a computer scientist, it's pretty high. Let's go with the nerd. So full. Stop eating that. Hey, how was the competition? Stop. Uh, no, before you ask, I did not eat the earwax. He already ate it all. That would be disgusting. Little did I know I did. I can read I your mind. Sick son of a bitch. I even ate the earwax pyramid, <laughs> and I kept some in my pocket as a little snack. But You're later, gross. I wonder how many carbs there are in earwax. So, so how was the competition? <laughs> it's pretty oh, nutritious, good. right? We came in fifth place, so we got $10,000. Oh, nice. I feel bad for the guy who came in fourth, though. Yeah, so you know that piece of brain that Jeffy pulled out? Well, that part of his brain was the part of his brain that knew how to solve a Rubik's Cube. You could have had a million, oh, that though. that sucks. Well, how'd you like my rocket ship? It was cozy. It was very fast. Maybe not that. Yeah, it's a Jackie Chu ship. guy. And uh, the fuel for that bitch is pretty expensive. Oh, no. You got to pay him fact, back. I think one gallon costs about $10,000. Gotta pay him back oh, now. Oh, there. Ten grand. What a coincidence. But no, I don't have to pay for your gas. Hey, I gave you my rocket ship. I gotta pay for the gas somehow. He did give you a rocket, man. Oh, you gotta, you gotta be fair. All that was for nothing. <laughs> well, gang, if you want to make money, I got a cheese factory in my ear and a chocolate factory in my ass. Ah. I've been trying to call my brother Jonathan. Anybody see him? Oh, like, my God. Like, was he at the Rubik's Cube He's dead, man. He's usually there. Well, he said he always got fifth place, and this year we got fifth place. So <laughs> your brother's dead, man. <laughs> R.I.P. Jonathan, you will be very much missed. You were a very funny character on SML, but yeah, you, you, you die. <laughs> but 10 grand for not doing anything. Too bad you had to pay Brooklyn back for that rocket fuel. I mean, rocket fuel probably isn't cheap, but I don't know. Is it really $10,000 a gallon? I don't believe that. Not for a single second. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the second channel. Link is going to be in the description below. Also, don't forget to hit the bell. That way you're notified every single time your boy uploads a video. That was it for this video, guys. My name is Prince of Hawkum. Stay charmed, my friends.